Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I did a small haul of tin hauls, uh, you know, my favorite, <laughs> and I found really good prices this time. This is uh, what you're seeing right now. This is one of his configuration box uh, from Ideology, and I believe this is the biggest one from the family. It's flat, it's not as thick as the other one, because the other ones are more like shadow boxes, but this one is like the tray. And I completely love it. It, it. This thing runs around 14 to 15 dollars, and I found it for 4.99. There's the price. I don't know if I can do a zoom of that. It's kind of difficult, but there, 4.99. It. It. Let me see if I can turn it around so you can see the different um, ways you can configure this configuration box. And these are the examples that you can do with this tray. Okay, I think the the reflection is kind of not letting you see, but there you go. Those are the ways you can actually accommodate this tray uh, to make something beautiful. I can't wait really to do this. Uh, as the the good thing about having this one is that I, if you remember, my, one of my last videos, I got like two more team holds I think I believe it was in the two dollar video two dollar back from Michaels I got two more uh, team holds paper pads so I have a total of three now which is awesome so from that I'm gonna put her away cuz kinda like big and maybe the reflection might bother you so that's that the next thing I got is some more divers from Adirondack. These are the acrylic paint divers. This is gold, pitch black, and snow cap. Uh, this is, you see, they run like $9.99. You can see that. And they were for only $3.99. So I love these. So I just, because of the price, I'll just keep them. And my, I have a f these colors already, but um, because of the price, I'm gonna keep them because they run out really fast, and I really like to use them. So that was cool. Then I got paint nibs, uh, brush tips from Ink Essentials from Ranger as well. And then again, you see this was five ninety nine. I just got it for one ninety nine. I thought it was really cool. I do use them because I have the pen nib. I don't know if you know about this. This is really cool to use them with the distress markers or your ink pads or really, really cool stuff. I, I'm looking for, oh, here it is. This is what they call the pen nib from Ranger. And all you do once this nib's kind of like, if you use different colors, you can use different nibs or this if this goes you know worn out you have a set of nibs that you know it will help you out with your work I love this pen nib it's, it's very useful especially if you want to color it with your ink or your stress with your distress markers I got as well uh, a new 20 piece Ranger etiquettes tags from Ranger I needed them. I'm running out of it. You know, I love using this tag specifically for my 12 tags of 2013 from Team Holtz. This is the size I like to use. So that was a good thing. I think I got a 40% a off on that too. Then I got um, the mini numerals from Team Holtz. I'm running out of these. So as well, I got some new. They were also, you can see, they were for $4.99. I think they were for more. Well, here it says $4.99, but I got them for $1.99. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. See? Guys, I don't know what's going on over there, but they really, uh, finally, they have downpriced a lot of Team Holtz uh, merchandise over there and my Michael. So I'm really pleased with that. These, see, like I said, see, $9.99, $3.99. I have never gotten this, and these are like the 19 pearls 
I don't, I don't know, I don't even know how to pronounce that word, but baubles. Oh, there you go. Baubles, there are small ornamental or showy pieces which can be added to jewelry or paper craft projects as a decorative element. So, I have never gotten this because, see, the, the, you see what I mean about the prices here? I'm telling you guys, every time I see your host, it's like, how can you get those prices? And here we go. So, the other thing I got from Tim, guess what? Another paper pad. But this one in particular is fun because these are the 8x8. Eight eight. I've never seen an 8x8 eight eight, um, paper, paper pad from or stash from Tim Holtz. And let me see if I can just open it here and show you which is this paper and this this the title for this one is cachette de papier no uh, doesn't say it says eight by eight collage paper stash team holds ideology usually it says like a deem i don't know okay let's see if i can open this very carefully there we go go here very carefully again without destroying the paper there we go all right this is very fascinating to me because I love his paper I you know his paper is like and I'm I'm kind of like hoarding all the paper and it's kind of crazy but I you know I'm, I'm starting to using it on projects so oh look at this look at that the new sets of stamps has this mat. look at this guys look at this paper oh I love it it's so vintage this is so nice look at this look at this isn't that cool I love his paper I'm sorry I can't stop saying that because I really do and a lot of you agree with me so look this is cool very nice paper and all of them are different they're not you don't have like two by two or two pieces of the same thing they're all different look at the tickets love the tickets you gotta love them this paper for me is so fascinating look all oh, pictures and he I think I mentioned this before but he came out with the fabric oh my god I can't wait to see that fabric like it, it looks like the paper though it's really really cool stuff if you don't know about that yet so there you go that's the 8x8 I think it's lovely then this is not Tim Holtz okay so I'm gonna show you what I got because I thought it was cool it was on sale as well this was only 50 cents and I guess it's because it was open and they are like little hands I've seen in the past if you see Team Holtz, uh, a compendium of curiosity, you know, books. So I, I think if I'm not mistaken. He used to use a lot of like hands, not like this, but, uh, but in a different way. So when I saw this, I said, oh, so, you know, for the projects, it will be really cool. This is chipboard. And then I got this set of stamps from Inka Dinka Do. These are um, clear stamps, and it doesn't tell me the title for this one, but I thought it was kind of like the way I like the stamps. You know, the balloon. You know, kind of like you see, bon voyage, be unique, happy birthday. A little girl told me. Take wind, shine, get up and glow. Thinking of you always cheers me up. Life's journey has many paths. I thought it was kind of cool. It's sort of like, you know, my favorite 
theme, vintage kind of thing. I thought that was pretty cool. And then this one, I this this and it was for sale. Look, nine ninety nine, three ninety nine again. That's Michael's for you right there. And then I got this at Joanne's. This is the Crafter Essential, and the story of this was that last week they had the Team Holt one, the picker. I think that's what they call it from uh, Tonic. And I've been in the store I don't know how many times, and I'm gonna say, okay, I'm gonna pick it, but I need the coupon to get it so I get the, the discount. And I'm gonna get the coupon. I'm gonna get the coupon, and finally yesterday when I went over there, I was like. Oh, I'm gonna buy it. Yoo-hoo! And when they got there, no pick. I was like devastated. So I was so devastated that when I saw this on sale, it was like 50% off over at Joanne's because I really need one and I'm gonna show you why. This is. There you go. <laughs> the accident just happened. This is the one I use. Look. This is the my little. See the pick there? Look, it's bended. It's not only bended, but when I use it, the danger is, is that it goes out. You see that? It goes completely out of the thing. And it's kind of dangerous sometimes. And I really need one. I really do. It, it's like an, an emergency mode. And I couldn't. I don't have any more of that Team Holtz tonic. But... Hey, I think this will work for me. So, I got that. And I got the, for my art journal, this was only $4.49. And I'm going to open it here with you because I couldn't believe it. This is very rare to see on sale. I don't know why it was on sale. I have no idea. Probably because they got out of a package or something. And they just decided to just put it on sale. And I was like, whoa, no way. Because usually they individually, like this, just one is probably seven, five dollars over here. Look, these are stencils. This is like a trophy. This is Go Team. You see that? Go Team. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, super. It looks like it's a, a team oriented stencil, so like from Sports C, basketball, football, baseball. I mean, for the prize, I couldn't, you know, resist. These, I don't know what they are. Oh, they're like stickers. Letters. And this is from Elmer's. Okay. Well, I can use them. And these are more stencils, see? Let's see if it's complete, the whole package. Whole package rings. One set, but one set of how many? Well, it brings a bunch, that's for sure. Let's see that? Let's see. Cause these are things that are all open, and they just want to get rid of them. See, these are letters. A B C D. I guess A B. These are kind of like weird letters, but I guess it's fun to use them with my journal. That's the whole purpose of buying this was that. Yeah, I can do something with this. This is going to be fun to use because I really don't have stencils. So I'm starting to see what are my options to start getting some because sometimes I just want to use them on my art journal. So that's that, but the best part of this haul, guys, and I'm going to show you what it is right now, and I also um, thought about it was great for the 
opportunity that they have a price. Guess what, guys? Look at this. Guess what this is? These are the distressed stabbers. Look at that. I got four. So I got four, five, six. And for the price of two, I will get one free. So I kind of got like the primary color, sort of. And then I got white and the vintage photo, which is my favorite, at least on the ink, on the ink pad, you know, collection. I, I was like, like, I really, they brought in this like two weeks ago over at the store. And I'm been like going around and around in the section where they are. My surprise about this, guys, is how small it is. But, it's the stress. So I got it. <laughs> so I got, let's see, we got Broken China, Mustard Seed, Barn Door, Peel Paint, Picket Fence, and the famous Vintage Photo, which is this one right there. I am completely happy with this like I will try to complete the set though but they're quite a little bit expensive but I'll try because I really really I every time I see how things are done with this videos or pictures about how you can use this distress paint I fall it's completely I fell in love with them so I just I need to have them as well my ink pads that I haven't finished I mean there's a lot of like my distress markers I don't have them all the vintage the distress inks I don't have them all the crackle paints the I, I, I have so much to cover but guys this video has gotten long and I want to thank you all you guys for watching this video if you like what you see please rate comment and subscribe and thanks for watching goodbye